Hi, I'm Kara with BTOD.com. Today I'm going to show you how to adjust your Steelcase Leap V2. If you like this video, let us know by subscribing to the channel, turning on your notifications, and also don't forget to follow us on our other social media. Let's get into the video. The first adjustment is the seat height. To adjust the seat height, lift your weight from the chair and pull up on the right side lever. The seat height helps bring the chair to a level where you can sit with your feet flat on the floor and knees bent at a 90 degree angle. The seat depth is the measurement from the back of the chair to the front of the seat edge and determines how far back you sit in your chair. To properly adjust the seat depth to fit you, pull up on the left side, left lever and slide the seat forward or backward. You will want there to be at least a one inch gap from the back of your knees to the front edge of the seat. The back tilt on the Steelcase Leap V2 can be adjusted by flipping down the right side lever. There are five different back tilt positions. Once your seat and backrest are fitted properly, you can adjust the recline tension to your liking. To adjust the recline tension, turn the knob on the front right side of the seat. Turn it clockwise to tighten and counterclockwise to loosen. To adjust the lumbar support, slide the two handles on the side of the backrest up or down so that it fits comfortably in the curve of your lower back. To adjust the firmness of the lumbar, turn the knob on the right side of the frame clockwise to tighten and counterclockwise to loosen. The Steelcase Leap V2 has height arm adjustments with arm cap adjustments such as width, depth, and pivot. When adjusting the arm height, hold the buttons on the side of the arm caps to raise or lower. You will want the arm height adjusted so that your arms can rest at your sides and elbows bent at a 90 degree angle. And that is how you adjust your Steelcase Leap V2. If you like this content, let us know by liking this video, subscribing to the YouTube channel, and don't forget to follow us on our other social medias. Thanks for watching.